Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we don't really talk about hardware too much, but I thought a recent post and announcement by Google was worth a video and was quite interesting. Where Google has unveiled and announced its latest quantum chip called Willow. And that's according to this post dated the 9th of December. Meet Willow, our state-of-the-art quantum chip. And I'll leave this post linked in the description because it's quite an interesting read. But I'm just going to um, skim over the highlights as a quick overview for the purpose of this video. Now, according to Google, its quantum chip took less than five minutes to perform tasks that would take even the fastest supercomputers 10 septillion years. That's quite a large number. Now, just to put this all into perspective, I've just typed that out as a visual representation quickly in Notepad. So another way you could look at this is that 10 septillion years could also be 10 billion, billion, billion years. And that's a lot of zeros, as you can see. And in case you're unaware, at its core, quantum computing is different from so-called classical computing because it uses quantum bits called qubits, spelled Q-U-B-I-T-S, that can exist in multiple states simultaneously which allows for greater computational power. So like your regular computers, they use bits, which are zeros and ones. Qubits can use both zeros and one at one time simultaneously. So that's the difference between regular computing and quantum computing, just as a quick side note in case you are unaware. Now, according to Google and the article, they ran an experiment um, for Willow to demonstrate a major reduction in the error rate by scaling up from smaller grids of qubits to larger arrays, which achieved real-time error correction on a superconducting quantum system. Now, according to Google, and I'm quoting, they say, we achieved an exponential reduction in the error rate. They mentioned that this historic accomplishment is known in the field as below threshold, being able to drive errors down while scaling up the number of qubits. So basically, in terms of performance, according to Google, there's nothing to match um, Willow. And they say the classically hardest benchmark that can be done on a quantum computer today was demolished in a matter of minutes. So as mentioned, the same task took one of the fastest supercomputers available, an astonishing, as mentioned, 10 septillion years um, to work through. So according to Google, nothing to match Willow. Now, obviously, this is according to Google. But if you are wondering if this is going to make it to your PC any time, I don't really think so. Because for now, quantum computing um, in general and Willow, as an example, are really for highly experimental and specific tasks. Um, they don't really function or you are using everyday applications at this stage. So um, I thought this was interesting. And go check out the article. Um, um, as mentioned, that will be linked down below. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.